Question 10 was a true or false question. So consider the following. Is the reaction and statement below true or false for part A? So um, the answer was true. So this actually does occur. So the best way to figure this out is by actually doing the mechanism. So first things first, your double bond grabs onto the H, displaces bromine. And so this product would mean that our carbocation would be um, in this spot right here. So we would have our carbocation right here. And um, this actually makes sense. So that would mean our H was added there. This makes sense because um, looking at our stability trend, um, benzylic is most stable, allylic is the second best, then tertiary, secondary primary and then the least stable would be your um, methyl. So here allylic would be more, um, allylic is a carbon away from a single or a double bond, I'm sorry. So allylic would be more stable than something that was secondary. So that's how we know that our carbocation is in the right spot and that this product is actually going to form. So then your Br- minus will come in. Um, either from the top face or the bottom face. That's why we get plus an antimer. And um, so that product is formed. So the answer is true. And the second part was if you chose false, then provide any additional products that are not shown. And um, we didn't have to do that since we got true. So.